at the start line of the Greater Manchester Marathon, where over 7,000 runners are embarking on their 26 mile journey throughout the outskirts of South Manchester. Since the London Olympics, it was the first major sporting event to take place in Manchester, and although it was a year ago, the spirit shown by communities during the Olympics was still evident throughout Sunday's marathon. Well, we thought it was absolutely great. Last year was wonderful with the Olympics coming to Trafford. And we had, as you know, here in Manchester United, we had lots of football matches were played here. I think it's, it's a good thing all round. It's, it's just an opportunity not to be missed. Former long distance running world record holder, Dr. Ron Hill started the marathon off and he's already looking ahead to next year's race. It was a bit of a disaster last year with a lot of things going wrong and the weather being so terrible. Only just over 200 people actually dropped out last year. Now there's going to be positive, positive vibes about the event again and uh, more and more people are going to come into it, definitely. It would be nice to sort of have the race going through the city to start with and then out to Trafford and uh, you know it just it, it would, you know Manchester needs and has got a big city marathon except they could just start on the outskirts. The race was eventually won by Dave Norman in a time just over two hours and 22 minutes. Race director Simon Hill expressed his delight in the support from the communities of Trafford. Yeah definitely right from the very very start from the first meeting we had with Trafford Council it was emphasised that this was a community marathon and we wanted to include as many communities as possible. It's been a fantastic event today, the Greater Manchester Marathon. Communities from Sale, Altrincham, Ermson and Stretford have all come together to show that the Olympic spirit still lives on. Sam Rosbottom, Keys News.